What's going on, guys? You know what it is. Back guys, pick 'em, nick 'em, DJ and Den. Back at it once again. Week seven football. Football, football, football. I love it. They should literally pick, play 52 uh, weeks of the year. I mean, at yeah. the end of the day, every week we want football. Yeah. We're going right into it. Our We're man. giving away all our picks this week. Uh, something we don't normally ever do. We're going to um, run through week seven. The whole thing. Here we go. Right away. Jump right into it. His Bills Mafia versus J-E-T-S Jets Jets Jets. Duh Losers. Blues. Duh Bills. I'm with um, that right away on the Bills. Minus 12. Minus 12. They're coming out hot. Right away. Next game. Easy. <laughs> Done. Easy win. <laughs> Divisional game. Panthers on the road at Saints. Saints minus 7. Don't forget. Bat Ben, earlier in the year, we called that against Oakland. Bat Bands. Uh, <laughs> Bat Bands. We hate Bat Bands. It's no Bat Bands. It's Tuddy Bridgewater. He's up against his previous team. I think he's got something to prove. I, I think, think he's so got. Too. I'm teasing this. I'm taking Panthers plus 10. That's that's pretty generous. Okay. Uh, I think the Saints do pull it off. I think it's going to be tighter than that. So I'm teasing the Saints down to about. Two and a half. Ooh. Two and a half. I think it's going to be a field goal game. Ooh. I think so. That's going to go real tight there. Uh, next, Battle of O-H. O-I-O. I-O. Shout out Big Ten. Thank you for coming back. Buckeyes. Uh, we got the Browns on the road as a favorite. Minus three against Joe Burrow. LSU. Yep. Yep. Go Tigers. Battle of the Heismans. Big Heismans. Oklahoma Sooners. LSU. It's like college day all over again. Love college game day. Game day. Love, Love game day. Um, this, this game's <sighs> tough. This game's tight. tough. I was talking about this, and I think it's going to be an absolute shootout. I'm going over on the 50. Yeah. You know what? You you mentioned that earlier. You got that stuck in my head. I'm going to double down on that, but I do like Baker to come out and show. It's going to fire away. Okay. Not show bad. us Kareem Hunt. Show me some magic, I, I, please. I, that's true. Sh I, that's true. You got some weapons. Sh Odell, Landry. <laughs> Show me the magic. Please. Yeah. Uh, you know what? You're not wrong on that. I think, yeah. I think it's going to be a shootout at the end of the day. I do like the Browns, too. I think it's way yeah. field the game. Yeah. Next up, the NFC least. Almost. Oh, do you want to talk about this game? Yeah, okay. We might as well. Ah. Cowboys on the road, yep. favorite against the football team, aka Redskins. <laughs> Nobody should be favorite in yeah, this game. No, seriously, it should just be a tie. Probably yeah, yeah, a tie again. Yeah. They should not even it, play. Yeah, it should. It might be a tie. Yeah. Realistically, though, Dallas oh is angry. They're angry they're internally. Dalton or Danucci. Dalton or Danucci. I like Red Rock. Red Rock's that, gonna come out in this game a little bit better. Oh, I don't know. But here's Zeke, the fun one. Zeke. Hold on to the fucking football. Here's the final one, though. I don't even know what I was going to say. Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> Zeke, props. Two touchdowns, guaranteed. Lock that in. Two of them. Lock it in. Two, Two of them. One touchdown. hand. One hand. But this will be fun. I'll see, see Chase Young. Chase Young will be yep. grinding gears. Hired up. Uh, uh, so we're on, I'm, that, I'm, we're on the, I'm, on the I'm that one. Ain't nobody winning that game. Next game. Attack. Detroit Lions at Hot Atlanta. Atlanta, two and a half favorites. Atlanta came on hot. I fucked up last week. Yeah. You I forgot fucked, that they looked fired I the coach. Up last week. We're all on those Kirk intangibles. Kirk Cousins was saying, you like that? I was like, I like that. And I was wrong. I was wrong. I'm not going to make the same mistake this week. I'm on Julio. Not Matt Ryan. Julio. I like it. I like it. Two and a half. I'm with Lena as well. I think uh, they got too many weapons. But here's the funny thing is Detroit is such a weird ass team. They'll know, get blown out by Jacksonville, but then they'll play hard against a team like Atlanta. Or the we'll Saints. See. They play great against the Saints. Yeah, it's so weird. Yeah. I'm on Atlanta as well. Next up, Green Bay Packers. No brainer. Packers at the Texans. No brainer. Texans lost in overtime, a heartbreaker, but they got killed by Henry. Packers favorite minus three and a half. The Texans are the Texans. And at the end of the day, A.A. Ron went home. He's had a lot of self-reflecting, reflecting, <laughs> reflecting, okay? He's reflecting about it. Just like I'm reflecting on how to speak. He is going to drive the football into the end zone. He might even put up to himself. I don't know. But I'm taking Packtown. 
I think I like that too. I think uh, A.A. Ron had a nice, long, hard chat with Danica Patrick. And at the end of the day, she said, if you don't win this game, I'm out. If you're not first, you're, you're last. last. Packers, three and a half. We're on that as well. Book it. Next one. I think this is the game of the week right here. Steelers at Tennessee Tannehills. Undefeated. Tannehills minus one. This is a battle undefeated. Somebody's got to lose. Tana thrill. I like the thrill. Tana Hill. Whatever you want to call them. Tana something. Uh, Steel Town. Okay. Steel Town. Okay. I like that too. Even though King Henry, he's been absolutely dominating, guys. Key thing it's, is, Devin Bush, out linebacker for the Pittsburgh Steelers, 20 CL. Um, so so does Henry just like put his head down and go? Does just, he even need to? Like, get off me. Does he, like he need to? Or does he just like... You know what? It's it's tough. I mean, it's going to come down to the defenses, but I do think... Does Paul Amalo come out of retirement <laughs> for this game? This is going to be a shootout. I yeah. also like the over. I'm not even I do that. like the over on this I game. I like that one too. I like the over on this game a lot. Um, so we're going Steelers. Plus one. Uh, you know what? You might as well go money line because that's paying better money there. Hondo. The Bucks at the Raiders. This has moved to Sunday night football because of COVID. Um, the, Ra the Raiders in Las Vegas, the new stadium. Yep. Their top O tackle, blindside tackle, Trent Brown's out. He's got COVID. That's a tough one. The I Bucks defense was real good last week. I think week. I've seen that movie before. Blindside. Yeah. I know how it ends, so don't spoil it for me. <laughs> okay. Um, I like the other storyline here. I like John Gruden against a team that he won the Super Bowl with. I think Derek Carr comes out and plays. I think the Raiders are trying to make it up to the next level. I think they're trying to push. I really like the Raiders money line right now. We don't know what the spread is. Yeah, but right I now, would take it's off the board, but if, we'll see. If it was a pick 'em, I'm on the Raiders. It's going Raiders. All right. I actually think I'm I'm going against Pick'em Nickem, so this might be the challenge of the week. <laughs> head to head. Uh I like I like Brady. I like Brady again. He's connecting with Gronk. Yeah. He's got Godwin back. Evans. The defense is playing well. Uh I know John he loves playing John Gruden loves playing Brady. But at the end of the day, I still think the GOATs got it. And I think they're going to come out hard. And I think this is a money line win for the Bucks. Yep. Never mind the spread, even though we don't know it. I'm on the Bucks. All right. Next game, you got Minshew and the mustache at Justin Herbert. Is he the real deal? Chargers. Chargers minus seven. That's a lot of points for the Chargers right now. It's a lot of points. Although they were, on, they were in all of their games that they lost. It's a lot of points. It's a tough one. I'm personally teasing this down. To the Chargers, two and a half. I think it's a field goal game. Yep. Because Jacksonville can be one of those game teams that just oh, where do you know they score three touchdowns for some s stupid reason? If you if you look at the money line, it's like Vegas is teasing you with the mm -hmm. the minus seven, but they're like okay, minus three seventy. Ah. Take take the Chargers. I think Minshew. This could be an upset of the week, but I'm gonna tease this as well. I'm taking the Chargers minus three. Herbert showing me a lot more than he needs to. Especially at this point in his career, I'm locking in the Chargers. Minus three. Quick fun fact here. As a diehard Dolphins fan, I was actually rooting for them to pick up Justin Herbert instead of Tua. Reason being, uh, I know those injuries. That's your quarterback. <laughs> That's my quarterback. My quarterback. my quarterback. Yeah, I wanted them to pick up Herbert only because those injuries, like dis dislocated hip, yeah. not fun to deal with. I played with a guy and the same thing happened to him. Yeah. Never played again after that. So... It's crazy that two is back out there. And um, number one. Yeah, and now starting, which I think is the right, uh, right wow. deal. We'll see after their bye week uh, coming up. And they do face the Rams, which is a tough defense. Yep. Next up, we got the defending champion Chiefs on the road, mile high, Chiefs nine and a half. Drew it's, it's a, it's, Locke. It's a Drew lock for myself. It's going down. <laughs> it's going down. It's going down. Um, the, Chiefs, the Chiefs built some momentum. Uh, I do like Drew Lock. I do like the mile high. I like that combination. It's such a tough spread. Um, you do got to take the Chiefs. I'll dumb the Chiefs down. I'll dumb them down to five. I'm going to tease it. Okay. Minus five on the Chiefs. All right. Uh, I mean, that's that's pretty crazy. I, I'm looking at this over 45 and a half for some reason. It's standing out to me. I think I'm going on the over. I like um, it. Broncos might not put up a lot of points, but I feel like the Chiefs are going to put up a ton of points. So. Yep. So I like the over, and I'll take nine and a half points too. I just feel, take them all. Yeah, I, I just, just feel feel like Drew Locke's not gonna have anything, and they got Le'Veon Bell, so we'll see what happens here. Yep. Next up, you got the 49ers traveling across the country, Road Dogs plus two against New England favorite. COVID Cam, Belichick. Oh, COVID Cam, CC. 
I don't know. Actually, I it's, do. It's still, <laughs> it's still Belichick. I know where you're going with this. It's still Gillette Stadium. They haven't changed the name of the stadium. It's still the same. You got Josh McDaniels. You have uh, Bill Belichick calling the shots there. They they always seem to find the plays that suit the team's needs or, or basically use the skills that the team has. Two and a half. The the forty nineers are hot. They're hot right now. I think uh, they played well against Rams after getting blown out by my Dolphins. Thank you very much. Uh, plus two, myself personally, I'm on the road dogs at plus two. Even though they lost Mostert, going across country, I'm not yeah. so worried about it. Uh, but it, it could be tight, but I'm going 49ers plus two. Well, you might as well take a money line at this point because I think that's yeah, a better plus, deal. Plus 110. Um, I, I do like the Patriots at home. I, I still think that they're a heavy contender, but I'm an odds guy. I love seeing the, the money line there. I like the Giants at plus 110. The Giants? The Giants. The New York Giants. The New York Giants. 49. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next game. We got the Seahawks on the road. Favorite minus three against the Bet Band. Lifted. Band. Cardinals. The Bet Band is lifted off the Cardinals. Well, you know, it, it's taken some, some weeks for Kyler Murray to get the Bet Band lifted, but uh, he's done it. I think uh, the, the combination between DeAndre and himself is kind of. Uh, put us back in the more comfortable feeling. I, I, I like think them. so. But it's, it's a fucking bad week for that. It's, it's, yeah, that's <laughs> tough. Yeah, That's tough. Coming back, uh, Seahawks off of their bye. Uh, a lot of talk and then pick up Antonio Brown. We don't even know. We'll see what happens there. Yeah, Russ, MVP for me. Three points at the Cardinals. This is a tough one. It could be a shootout on the over. I like 56. That's a high number. But yeah. at the end of the day, I'm still going with Russ and the minus three. I like Russ. Okay. DK? Ron, ooh, that guy's a monster. DK. Monster. What an absolute monster. DK. All right, that's that's the slate for Sunday. Um, all of that. Uh, leave us your comments, but the bonus. Monday Night Football. I hope you stayed around for it. I hope so, too. Before you get to that, before we get to that, Monday Night Football, we should know, you should follow us on Instagram, the Bet Guys. We have a wicked giveaway for all of you uh, on the Monday night football game, go to the bet guys on Instagram, the dot bet dot guys. And, uh, you know, do what we say, win some merch. Easy as that. Just win it. Okay. You, lo you like the logo. We like you. You want some merch? Let's go. And this That's is a it. pretty cool merch, especially for these times. Bears plus six on the road at the Rams. The Bears. Um, big dig, Nick. BDN. Uh, Jared Goff, Goff, Big Dick Nick. Jared Goff, Big Dick Nick. I'll take uh, Bears win in the fourth quarter. Ooh. Ooh, you love the, he loves his fourth quarter here. Swing. The Bears have been unreal. Yeah. Uh, I think they're plus nine. They're plus like 30 in the fourth quarter or something like that. They so show some, up. They, it's, it's, like, it's like, I don't know why they show up for the first three, but they show up for the four. It's true. This one's a tough one for me. I don't even know. It could be go both ways. The defenses could be solid. Yeah. 45 points. It could be under, um, but both teams have some offense. It's tough. I think the Rams will pull this out, but I might just tease it down again in minus two, keep them with a field goal. Uh, that way I kind of keep myself safe and win some big bets. That's what we want you guys to do as well. Rams are vulnerable. Big dick Nick. Money line. He's I'm going the Bears. That's, Bears. that's a huge one. Plus 215 on the Bears. Hope you guys take it. Remember, Instagram, the.bet.guys. Like yeah. us, subscribe. We got a Wicked Merch contest. Uh, we'll have more of them. We're going to have more of them. Uh, we got some live merch coming up, so we might as well send it to our fans. Listen, week seven, uh, we don't normally do this, but maybe we should do it all the time. Give away our picks, week seven. If you want more picks, more insider, what we're betting, props, send us a DM. Yep. Pick them, nick them. DJ Den, bet guys. Let's go. Woo!